Hi, Stevie BBs. The fan club's in again. Just one member so far. Again, don't really need it because this morning is drizzling, drizzling. Friday, July the 3rd, 2020. I got my ninja ribbon on because nothing's stopping me today, except the weather. We've even got the heater on here in the studio, which is filling up rapidly with stuff again. I did try and sort it a bit yesterday, but I seem to have made it worse. Well, I got rid of a lot of stuff, but now there seems to be less space than ever. I will get it sorted. 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 Repetition. That's the name of the game. Anyway, on. Excuse me. Dropped a leg. Not my leg. My granddad had a leg that sounded like that. <laughs> but that's an old table leg. We've got four of them. We don't know what they came off. They're at the mother-in-law's. So anyway, here we have today's painting. Again, it's 80 centimetres by 80 centimetres. It's called 04 slash 19 Green Man. And it's got cross what's it on it, which makes it sturdier than yesterday's. Bevel, not quite so good. Don't know where this came from. A bit stingy on the canvas, along the edges. But it will do. It will do. It's strong enough. And this is what it is. Yes, it's an abstract. Yay! Another painting from the middle section. Now, I call this Green Man because as Quite often happens in my abstract. It gets to be like looking at clouds where you see, oh, there's an elephant, oh, there's an alligator, oh, there's my dad, that kind of thing. Well, I'll get to see things in my abstracts and it became quite clear from the other side. I don't know if we can see it here. Oh. There. Forest. Eye, nose, nostril, mouth. It's a man's face. And he's inside the nature of it all. Because it's got leaves on it. I was tempted to call it something along the lines of autumn or if you're American, fall. But fall to me would be tempting fate and it might just fall off the wall. So Never using that word. So I called it Green Man. Although it's not green. But Green Man lives in the countryside, doesn't he? He's part of nature. And so there he is. I can see him very clearly. Very clearly. It doesn't look like anybody I know. But who knows? Maybe it's somebody from the spirit world making their presence known to me. For some strange reason. When you get up close, when you get up close, it's not really so obvious. But aside from the face, I love uh, all the leaves and the different tones of the similar colour, which makes the whole painting work. It binds it all together. The darker leaves just give you a little bit of relief from the oneness of it all and yet it still remains a oneness if you see what I mean there really isn't enough room in here to be showing you this on, on that little video screen I can't get back far enough if I get back can you hear me still I don't know there's a false light in here because the halogen lamp is yellow so we're getting a yellow tint a tint to everything including my yellow jumper. <laughs> and my face looks quite, you know, illuminated, which it is because there's a halogen lamp in there. 
So, there we go. I think this is a nice cardboard box. Keep it safe and secure. I'm going to put it away now because I know what will happen now. I've said the word fall. <laughs> it will fall. So, turn it around. I want it that way. Well, where would you go in? Oh, oh, oh. silly Billy. It's got to go that way. It has to go that way because I've got uh, mirror plates on it. It's too big for the box. The box is just the size. Voila! I'm going to put it away, straight away. Into the middle section. Into the middle section. That way. And that goes that way because I've written on the box the title. So I just look down, I can see them up here, the titles. You see, are on the bottom of the pictures. As you see, they are here. They on the bottom of the canvas, so when they're on the wall, you won't see them. So I can see them here and find them quicker if somebody says, I want to buy that one. And then I can just put my hand on it, hopefully. That's my cataloging system. Got the old ninja thing on. Did they tell you about that? It's just a joke, really. I'll just take it off. It's just a a ribbon that I found. Pull it off my ear. There we go. I thought that might be quite fun to do that. Not much else to tell you, really. No, not really. It's all waiting around. I've got a little bit of work to do at Margaret's house. Mother-in-law's. And some little cracks that need filling in with polyfiller. Nothing much. And my Ned Ryder sand it down. I've got my dad's old electric sander. And if not, I'll just use manual sandpaper. So that's today sorted. Oh, my mother is having a, a man come to, well, I say man, it might be a woman. Coming to measure for blinds in a window, because since we've had them, she must have them. So, uh, yeah, we have to be there for that because she's very deaf. Uh, so, yeah, that's about it, really. The COVID thing, it's taking off again in Leicester. Apparently in Scotland there's an area, Dumfries and Galloway, where they're not allowed to drive for more than five miles. Wow. That's real lockdown, that is. That's not just saying, please stay at home. That's saying, stay at home. Five miles is your lot. So they can't get out to a bigger city to do any shopping or anything because the police will stop them. They're quite strict in Scotland. If you had one little drink and you drive your car, they take the car off you. Wah! <laughs> That's what my Scottish in-laws told me anyway. So, yeah. So, Bill, here we go. Going to have to love and leave you, babes. We've all been here 11 minutes, chuntering away about nothing. Remember, love all, hurt none, and walk in soft shoes. We've seen you, babies. Woo!